I learned early in life that people do things as if they're on autopilot. And when I challenge them and say, well, why would you do that? Or when I, you know, when I ask the question, they get offensive, offended because they can't really answer why they did what they did, right? So my point is that a lot of times we are moving throughout life not really rooted in our why or a foundation of belief or even committed to the belief system and what we're doing. So we do things in life and we don't even know why we're doing them, right? It's habitual. It's patterns. It's, oh, my mama used to do it, so I do it. But we have to, if we really want to get firm in our foundation and not waver from who we are and what we want in life, we got to begin to ask ourselves the question. This is not no one else's work. This is not for anybody else, right? This work is for you. Ask yourself why. Why do you do this? Why do I wake up at this time and do this first? Why do I pray in the way that I pray? Why do I not pray, right? When I wake up, why do I have a craving for coffee instead of water, right? I mean, all of those things. If you begin to become a scientist of yourself and a scientist of your life, then it is much harder for you to deviate from yourself.